Hey guys, what's going on? This week we're going to cover a question and we're going to talk about speakers. So the question was, is the Rocker 32 good for rehearsal? So yes, it's it's good for that. Um, it is switchable wattages. It is loud. Please bear in mind, it is a 30 watt to 10 combo. It's loud. I mean, you can get some really good sounds at low volumes, etc. You can switch it down to half power, which is 15 watts, which is great it's still loud. It'll definitely hang in a band situation. It'll definitely hang in a gig. If you don't want to bring your like OR100 and 412 or 212 home or whatever the case, leave that at rehearsal or use that to gig with and play the Rocker 32 otherwise. Yes, awesome. I will tell you that if you're a heavy effects user, uh, it will sound like you're missing something if you're using a different amp and using the Rocker 32 otherwise, because it being stereo, if you're using the effects loop, it does create, it doesn't create a huge stereo field because the speakers are right next to each other. But what it does do is give it a little more depth and you'll hear it right away. Uh, it is very cool to hear in the room. That's the only thing I'd really caution you with. Otherwise, the Rocker 32 is... It's awesome. Other thing I want to talk about was mixing speakers. I'm doing a speaker series, so you can check out some of those videos. Uh, I still have a couple more coming. I'll tell you what I've learned is that, you know, for 150 bucks, you can totally change the way your setup sounds by just changing a speaker out. Um, I'd encourage you to do some swapping yourself. Some of the cleans I've noticed aren't necessarily distinguishable. I mean, you hear differences, but they're not huge. Where you really hear it is on the dirt channels and you start overdriving things. The differences are dramatic. I mean, the compression, what that high end sizzle is versus the smooth mids, um, and even some of the lows if you're using a G12 H30, you're definitely gonna hear some crazy differences when it comes to the dirt channel, but I think mixing speakers is awesome. So definitely check out those videos. If you haven't tried to mix speakers, definitely try it. Um, like the V30, G12H combos. I really like the cream backs mixed with the V30. I haven't decided if I like the H75 and the M65 together. Um, H75 and the V30 are similar, but not quite the same. Definitely a cheap tone fix overall. So if you don't like an amp, I'd encourage you to try swapping the speakers. I think one of the more enlightening things I have found over the years is that Mesa amps with green back speakers actually sound pretty good. The mini rectifier, with a 212 open back with green backs. Oh, oh, that's a good time. That sounds really good. I was extremely impressed with that. But anyway, happy experimenting. I hope I answered your question. If you have a question, please leave your question in comments below. I will gladly answer them. If you have any requests, please also leave that. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Many more videos to come. Don't miss one sub.